My name is Sonia Shah and I am the Modern Foreign Languages Coordinator and the French and Spanish teacher at uh, Churchfield and Hounsfield Primary Schools in North London. Bonjour la classe! Bonjour Madame Shah! Très bien! Aujourd'hui, aujourd'hui, nous allons faire un gâteau. Nous allons faire un gâteau de chocolat. My great lesson idea is to make a no-cook chocolate cake uh, that I've actually found off the internet. And um, it, the children are going to analyse the recipe and then they're going to actually make the cake. The uh, learning objective is for them to listen to familiar words and phrases, listen out for them, and for them to read and recognise some words and phrases in, written, in the written form. It says, ajoutez, ajoutez le sucre, le cacao et le mélasse raffiné. Qu'est-ce que c'est mélasse raffiné? The year four children have been learning French for two years. I would usually probably introduce something like this where they're reading with uh, year five, but because these are more able, I um, thought, and I, I've supported them, so I think it's quite good for them, and it has been a successful way of uh, teaching them. So you need to put all four, un, deux, trois, quatre ing ingredients, ingredients in that one there, okay? And mélanger bien. Qu'est-ce que c'est mélanger bien? It says number, number trois, Mélanger bien. With this particular exercise, I think that you yourself as a teacher and the children get quite a lot out of it because you're having fun with them, the children are having fun, it's interactive, you're using teaching strategies that are visual, that are auditory, that are kinesthetic. To press it, okay, en français, so that there is no lumps. With this idea, I think um, there's sort of three parts to the lesson. And uh, the first one would be teaching the children the names of the ingredients and the verbs that they'd need for the method to make the cake. Before we start making, we're going to have a look at those verbs again. So we're going to play that game again where I'm going to say a verb and you're going to show me the action. And so I would use flashcards um, and uh, lots of actions and gestures and mind. Mélanger. Qu'est-ce que c'est mélanger? Chaya. Mix. Très bien, mix. Ok, mélanger. Mélanger. Très bien. Ajouter. Ajouter. Très bien. When you're teaching the verbs, get them, children, to do the actions. So, whatever you say, get them to make up the actions and then practice them in that way. And then the second part would be produce, presenting them with the recipe in French. And um, as they had learnt, the names of the ingredients and the verbs, they should be able to hopefully understand some of the things in the recipe. Say that. Okay, le micro-ondes. Le micro-ondes. What I do is I ask them in mixability pairs, mixability pairs to um, analyse whatever they can and highlight or underline, whatever they understand that is similar to the English. And then the last part is probably the most fun part, especially for them, and I think for me too, is to actually make it. And um, I will instruct them in French, um, basically reading off the recipe, very, very simple sentences, slow, uh, repetitive, and then supplement with English to help them understand. And they um, step, make it, make the cake step by step, and then they get to eat it.